Welcome into the Locker Room Report, Warrior fans. I'm Lisa Seymour alongside Coach Winners. A coach looking back um, at that tough loss up at Ferris State. Um, certainly not a game anyone was expecting, but what do you take away from a game like that? <laughs> I don't know. Um, it's a little disappointing because I thought we, we battled a little bit in the first half and, and moved the football at times, and, and we just did, didn't finish it. But then the second half, I think we uh, mentally we just weren't the same team. And moving forward, I know coaching staff and the team is certainly looking forward to this week's game and the, the game after that as well. Um, but a special day this Saturday at home, last home game of the season. It's senior day here at Wayne State. So just talk a little bit about the senior class and what they've provided to this program over the years. Well, the senior class has been very successful. Um, we've got guys who have um, been four-year starters, who've played in the national championship game, who've had you know six, successful seasons. Um, so we're going to lose a lot. And talk a little bit about this Grand Valley matchup. Uh, Grand Valley puts a lot of points on the board. They also give up a lot of points. Um, but talk about um, what you're expecting to see from Grand Valley this weekend and what you're expecting to see from your team this weekend. Well, Grand Valley is a team that runs the zone as well as anybody. Um, they, they stretch it and find seams, and, and they have very, very good speed in the backfield, so they're a tough team to compete with. Great offensive line, um, great receivers. Um, defensively, they have really good athletes all over the place. Teams have gotten after them pretty good, but they're a good defensive team. Um, from our team, I expect us to compete like heck. I expect us to um, be able to run the football better than what we've run it. Um, I think we've got some guys who are ready to explode offensively. And I think defensively, we're going to run around and try to get the ball out. A uh, good defensive team that, that we are, that should be you know, our number one goal. And talk a little bit about the rivalry between Grand Valley and Wayne State. I know there's a there's a story back there, and there's a history behind it. There's a wooden shoe cup between this matchup. Um, so talk a little bit about the rivalry and, and how that plays into this week's matchup. The rivalry gives you something to shoot for. Um, anytime you have something that there's a trophy on, um, even if you haven't had the trophy for a long time, it's something that you think about, it's something that you um, fight for. And it's something that we'll, we'll make sure that the guys understand how important it is. And before I let you go, keys to a Warrior victory. Keys to a victory for us this week, I think, is to put the ball in the end zone offensively. Like you said, teams have had success offensively against them. Um, and we haven't had great success. We need to have success finishing drives. And then defensively, we haven't created a lot of turnovers recently. We need to go back to creating a lot of turnovers. We do that. And again, you know, make one or two plays that are big in the special teams then we win the football game. All right. Well, Coach Winters, thanks so much for your time, and certainly best of luck. Thanks. Need it. <laughs> for Coach Winters, I'm Lisa Seymour. Thanks for joining us on the Locker Room Report.